Oh man, we have some fantastic Switch news today. Let's go. Oh, we have a terrible Reggie Fisa, man! <laughs> OB1 plays? Yes, right. What's up? Oh, All right. OB1 plays. going on everybody how are y'all doing we have some fantastic fantastic nintendo switch news today but of course before we get started as we do in every video give the video a huge thumbs up like 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 and if you're not subscribed click subscribe right now all right the first news item we have some splatoon 3 news and Splatoon 3 is now up for pre-order at local retailers. That's right, Amazon, Best Buy, GameStop, Walmart, both physical and the digital copy of the game at those retailers are now live and available. So if you're a physical guy and you don't want the digital version, you can go and pre-order the game right now. Me personally, of course, I'm going to get it through the through the eShop. I can't wait. Usually Nintendo has what they call the global test fire where we can, it's their demo of Splatoon where they get the kinks out for the online services so i can't wait can't wait until that happens splatoon 3 gonna be a day one buy but the game is now available for pre-order go and get your splat on boy or girl all right next news item capcom has issued two brand new gameplay videos for monster hunter rise sunbreak the DLC that's scheduled to be coming out later this year. You can find these videos on their official uh, Monster Hunter YouTube channel. <coughs> this is one of the best looking third party games on the Switch and the DLC dropping i believe at the end of june and so brand new gameplay brand new gameplay for the sunbreak sunbreak dlc make sure you go and check it out it may convince you to get the game if you're still on the edge all right bro i thought this next news item was pretty cool if you pre-order nintendo switch sports at walmart walmart is giving away an exclusive steel water bottle uh, while supplies last so if you're interested in getting a nintendo switch sports if you were going to get the physical version of the game you might as well get it at walmart if you pre-order it while supplies last so you got to get it while it's hot because i'm sure this is going to be for a limited quantity but you get a nintendo switch sport steel water bottle which i think is pretty cool so and it's only 50 but the game is 50 bucks to pre-order but you get a free steel water bottle if you do it through walmart you might as well go ahead boy speaking of pre-order bonuses probably my most anticipated game on the switch this year Mario Striker, um, Mario Strikers Battle League Football. They also have a pretty cool pre-order bonus. A Mario Battle League Fan Scarf is available if you pre-order the game via the UK, the UK My Nintendo Store. Now uh, that's an image of the scarf on the right side of your screen, which I think is pretty cool. I mean, if you're already going to pre-order the game, you might as well get, get these freebies. And this is a pre-order bonus for um, UK fans. Now, if they're doing this in the United Kingdom, I can imagine Nintendo is going to do something similar for us fans so stay tuned but my mario strikers battle league uh, i believe this game comes out on june 10th this is my most anticipated switch game 
for the year. The game looks crazy good. The gameplay in all of the Mario Strikers games are lit. And so can't wait, can't wait, can't wait for this game. And the last news item. Have you ever walked into a grocery store and said, hmm, I wish I had a Kirby shopping bag to put my groceries in? Well, today's your lucky day. My Nintendo has just added a Kirby and the Forgotten Land shopping bag for 600 platinum points. So if you have 600 platinum points, go over to the My Nintendo um, um, website where you can redeem your points and a Kirby and the Forgotten Land shopping bag is available. Now, of course, with every physical item, I think you have to still pay uh, shipping and handling, but the item itself is free, which is pretty cool. I think that it's pretty cool that Nintendo does this with the My Nintendo points. They've always been doing this for generations, but Nintendo would possibly have the best achievements in the world if they incorporated actual game achievements with my nintendo points and f actual items then people can stop saying achievements are pointless they're meaningless no you can get real life um collectibles especially if you're a fan um to just collect stuff and 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 have it have um items this is pretty dope all right dudes those are all of the news items for today april 14th what do you guys think about everything we talked about in this video sound off in the comment section below i want to know but before you go bro click that subscribe button stay up to date all things nintendo we out boy